Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn what to do if your A2 smart plug is not connecting to the Wi-Fi or is showing an offline status or if it's not working at all. So we will try different diagnostic steps that will surely resolve your concern. So let's get started. First of all, you need to make sure the distance between your smart plug and the router should be less than 100 feet. If you have poor signal strength at the location where you have plugged in the smart plug, then it will keep on getting disconnected from time to time. To resolve this, you can either set up a Wi-Fi range extender between your smart plug and the router, and then the Wi-Fi extender will extend the signals further to the A3 smart plug, or else you can set up access point or maybe set up a mesh system. You can watch video given in the description to learn which is the best option for you. Next, these plugs are only compatible with 2.4 GHz bandwidth. So if your router have dual band channels, then kindly make sure that your smart plug is only connected to the 2.4 GHz. Moreover, some advanced routers support single SSID which combines both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bandwidth. So your smart plug will also have trouble connecting to this network. And you can check if your router have these settings or not by logging into your router. Also, you can watch video given in the description to learn how to log in into your router. Thirdly, while trying to connect your smart plug to a router, make sure you enter the right password. Also, sometimes, if we change the Wi-Fi SSID or password, then also our smart plug will disconnect. So for that, first you will need to reset your plug and then set it up again. Watch video given in the description to learn how to reset A3 smart plug. Fourthly, if your router's SSID or password has any special characters, then also the Smart Life app will have hard time connecting to this network. So we recommend you, if the above step doesn't work, then try changing the SSID or password of your router. Also, sometimes the advanced security type of WPA3 security isn't supported by the smart plug. So you can log in into your router and change that too to a WPA2 security type. And if that also doesn't resolve your issue, then change the channels of your 2.4 GHz band to either 1, 6, 9 or 11. You can watch video given in the description to learn how to do it. Fifthly, make sure you are using the updated version of the Smart Life app. So it is recommended once to kindly update your app to the latest version. You can watch video given in the description to learn how to update the apps for Android and iOS. And lastly, if you found this video useful, then please do hit like and subscribe to support my efforts. Also, if you have any doubts or suggestions, then please do leave them in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you have a blessed day.